Three more rounds of action in the welterweight division. Fighting out of the red corner. He weighs in at 146 pounds, wearing the black trunks with the green trim. Representing Westside Muay Thai from Ottawa, Canada, with a record of 13 wins and two losses, two by knockout. Dirty Ben Payne. And fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the black trunks right now. He weighed in at 148 pounds, representing Square Circle, New York, with a record of eight wins and three losses. From right here in New York City, Kit Rock. General one, nice thing, fight away, my commands at all times. In case of a knockdown, go to neutral corner, I tell you to go to, remain until I call you out. Any questions over here? Any questions over here? Want you to fight fair, fight hard, touch your gloves. So now these guys, they've gotten through their first fight. They're going into their second fight. Aaron Fisher, what do you think's going through their head going into the second round of action for them? They're thinking, all right, I'm halfway there. I need to get through this guy and I'm in the finals. You know, so I think this round, they need to pick it up. They need to fight a little bit harder. Don't be so cautious in this round. They're halfway home. You know, both fighters coming off a three round decision. So I don't think mental edge plays a much part in this. I always found fighting in tournaments, that second fight, you kind of find your groove. Yeah. That first fight, it's a little choppy. You got a lot of stress. You're trying to, you know, feel things out. You're breaking that sweat. Now you got a little time to settle in. Second fight tends to be your best. The third fight's the one where, you know, yeah. that's your test of manhood. Yeah, you 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 in this you're both you're confident. You know, you the first fight after you win it, you can a little sigh of relief. Okay, I'm in. I'm good. I'm confident. This is exactly what I was expecting out of this fight. You've got Ben, he, you know, he's he's really he's trying the powerful clinch. You know, Kit, he, he's more light on his feet, moving a little bit more, a lot of combinations. Yeah, both both fighters looking to work hard here. Um, Kit's really light on his feet, a lot of hopping. Do you see anything different from either one of these fighters going into this fight after what we saw before? Ben looks like he's trying to push the pace just a little bit. He's trying to move forward just a little bit more. I actually think Kit's a little bit more effective in this fight. He's pushing a little bit more too, and it's working for him with Ben. Yeah. His, his style doesn't, I don't know if his style really dictates that that much pressure, pushing too much. No, Ben definitely likes to be the counter fight and go back, and that works well for him. You know, in a five round fight, you can you can get away with that a little bit more. You yeah, know, when, you're, when you're doing three two minute rounds, I always tell my guys, you, you gotta go out there and you gotta win, you gotta fight. You, you don't have time to, Look and look and look. You gotta work. Really effective work on closing that distance, hitting on the way in by Kit. I gotta yeah. go. I gotta go with Kit on that round. I agree with you, Brian. I think Kit did just enough to win that round. Kit's working that good jab. He's setting it up. He's being really offensive. It's throwing Ben's timing off. Ben's not able to get off what he wants to get off because Kit's constantly putting that pressure. Yeah, big head kick, good. And returned by Ben. There's definitely a difference in the speed. Kit's a, a faster fighter. Yes. Ben seems to be a little bit more, I'd say, a deliberate fighter. Throws a, ben, little bit, a little bit more bad intention. Yeah, Ben Ben seems hesitant this fight. Um, yeah. It looked like he had a lot more confidence in his, in his inaugural fight there in the tournament. Working a, a lower clinch this time. Yeah, I'm not sure not that's the right to, thing to do. Yeah, he's having trouble getting that uh, right angle on his hips to let the knees fly the same way. Now, ben, now Ben's finding that rhythm in the clinch, working those knees. Nice turn by Kit there. 
The minute you start to think that Ben's got a momentum, gets put in a, put a change up on the pace. Nice work by the referee ah, to keep the action going. Beautiful dump, beautiful dump. I think we got to give a little bit of assist to the referee on that one. A little momentum coming off those ropes. That's what you're supposed to do. Finals, they need to leave everything in the ring. Absolutely agreed. You, you can't play it safe. No. The guy who plays it safe is going home without that title. Tournaments are not times to play it safe. Kit stays moving, hitting those hands, stays out of that clinch. He's got a chance. I don't know if it's fatigue as a factor or what, but Kit's got, he's one step ahead right now. Good, good kick by Ben. Again, he's got a lot of power when he lands. It's a, it's a solid kick he throws. That's, that's, a, slip. that's a slip. It's nice to see that Friday Night Fights has a good reffing staff again. The crew can really recognize the difference between a slip and a knockdown. You know as well as me, yeah, that was there's a, good a lot hand. of bad refs out there. Yes, there is. Nice combination. Mm -hmm. That was something a little bit different. Ah, Ben chasing now. Big high I think kick, he but scored it was with that kick. It might have slipped through, actually. This is when the fatigue oh. factor is starting to set in. Ben's really finding his pace now. This is clearly yeah. his round. Ben's finding his pace now. He's doing some damage. Kit's getting a little bit, a little lighter on those, or heavier on those feet. You can see it in his eyes. A little bit tired right now. And he's getting a little more flat-footed, not bouncing in and out as much. Good round. Ben's really picking his targets on this one. You can see the momentum clearly shifting. Yeah. Kit started this round really strong. Ben landed a few hard shots and changed his momentum. Nice counter punch. Big hand by Kit. Great fight, great fight by both fighters. All right, ladies and gentlemen, at the three round time for the hammer winner by unanimous decision. From Ottawa, Canada, Dirty. That was the way I saw that fight as well. Yeah, I got to agree with that. The momentum shift there really did go to Ben's favor. Yeah. Kit started off strong, Ben closed it out. Yep.